Hi everybody, welcome back to Armour 3, welcome back to Profile, welcome back to the Mike Force game mode and as you can see we're in a bit of a bad state here, it is raining and it is dark so in this video I'm going to show you how you can stop the rain or start the rain I guess if you wanted to and also to set the time or skip the time as well. Now we're going to be doing it all through commands. Now this is pretty new to me, so forgive me if this is obvious to everybody. But what we can do is we can use these various commands, set date, set fog, force weather, this sort of stuff, in the escape menus, um, console commands. So let's for example go to force weather, and I'll put links to all of these in the description below the video. So if we see here, we can have this command here, um, force weather change so if we copy that and then we go back to the game and I press escape let's get rid of this stuff um, and in the debug console here you won't see anything so I'm going to press ctrl v to paste it in and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to change set overcast to zero and set rain to zero and we should just press enter and bingo the rain has stopped immediately similarly we could do set overcast to one um, and it would just go overcast probably a bit dark to see and set rain to one and the rain would come on now there are different values that you can have um, but you can only have rain if I think the overcast value is above 0.7 and the reason for this is you're playing solo and it gets dark or it starts raining and you just want it to be sunny again so what we can do now is we can now change the time and we can use the, there's a couple of different ways of changing the time we could use the set date so we would copy set this bit here set date and we could set it as well to let's copy that let's go to armor press escape let's just control v to paste it over the top let's set the date as 1966 um and let's set it for 0800 in the morning like that there we go so now it's daytime but it's still raining <laughs> which we don't want so let's go back to uh, force weather let's copy that put that over the top paste that in so let's set the overcast for zero and we can set the rain for zero Press enter. Hey, it's nice and sunny. You d oh, yes, yes, you do get rainbows. Oh, wow. Let me take a screenshot of that. Yes, you you can get r rainbows. I was trying to figure out how to force them in. I couldn't get it to work, but there we go. There is a rainbow in profile. I'm taking another screenshot because I want to see it. Anyway, the other thing you can do as well. Isn't that beautiful? Looks great, doesn't it? Let's just take another screenshot from over here so we can kind of get in the the base as well oh it's disappearing they only last so long the rainbows um so the other thing you can do as well is that's a little bit quicker is skip time see this command here so if we copy that and we go into the escape menu we can control v it over the top of those and we just press enter and we can keep pressing enter as you can see we're skipping through time now dark back into the next day it's gone overcast though, so we may well want to go into uh, force weather. Copy that. I mean, what I would probably recommend is that you have these commands uh, ready to go, say, in a uh, notepad document, so you can just have them ready to copy and paste. Or I guess you'd probably, you'd probably learn them after a while, wouldn't you, so that you wouldn't have to uh, copy and paste them. But there we go. That, my friends, is how you can change the time, the date, and the weather in SOG Profile, Mike Force, and the single player missions as well. Now I don't, th I think the reason why you can do this in solo Mike Force is because you are the server owner. I don't think you can just jump into a normal Mike Force and start changing the weather and changing the time. That, that, that would be crazy, wouldn't it? Um, and it also works in the uh, single player uh, campaign missions as well. You can go in and you can put the time forward, turn the change the weather and, and all that sort of stuff um so there we go so hopefully you find this video useful if you have hit like if you want to see more of the same press subscribe remember i'll put a link to all those different commands so you can check them out in the description below this video right i'll see you again soon